Hello everybody, welcome back to WWTF for the Facts the Game Show on Mike C. And I'm Fred Wild. Today we're here to talk to you about Zelda Breath of the Wild for the Nintendo Switch. Now this also came out on the Nintendo Wii U. But before we start talking about it, as always, we'd like to give it our rating. Mike, how many facts do you give Zelda Breath of the Wild? Fred, you know, with all the other people uh, reviewing it and saying how good it is, I was a little skeptical at first, but uh, the proof is in the pudding, man. Five out of five, bro. All right, uh, Mike, I'm going to go a little bit below you, man. I'm going to give this a three out of five. Mike? You suck, Fred. You don't like Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, why do you give this a five? <laughs> okay, for one, man, it's bringing back Zelda, man, and also on the new console. But I'm loving the story. I love what you could do with it. I love they made it like uh, the, with the little uh, animation that they got up on here, which is real good. And it's a perfect fit for the system. And, man, this is a fun game to play, man. Hours and hours of fun time. For me, you know, games that's on two consoles at the same time, that kind of gets me to thinking about whether it's good or not, because you got to remember, you got to port this game. And to me, when I looked at both of the games, they look real similar. It was like the, the Wii U version was a little darker than what the Switch version was. And, um, you know, I didn't get this game at all, man. You know, I, I get that it's an open world, but I, I just wasn't into it. I, I was like, thinking I was going to go to one certain spot and then, you know, warp into a world or get into a certain part of the world and fight enemies and then fight a mm -hmm. boss. It's like, it's an open world. I get it. Yeah, I like it. But it's like too much for you to even run into a boss or enemy to fight for me. Well, um, have you played the other Zeldas? I have not really played a Zelda game since <laughs> Nintendo 64. Okay. Well, for all those Zelda fans... <laughs> that aren't Fred, <laughs> you're going to love this game. <laughs> but uh, with, with Zelda, man, I know it's been so many iterations of it, man, and uh, it's something as far as an actual game character to keep bringing you back to their world and everything like that. But what the Switch did right here with Zelda, man, I think they did a real good job with this, as well as for the Wii U, for those people still having the Wii U. But remember, Wii U, this is the last console game coming out for that system so they're done shipping it they're not shipping they're not um manufacturing the more we use so that is it bro so if you're not on to the switch bandwagon i guess it's going to be your only outlet until something comes up in the future but right now on the switch i'm really digging it um like i said i like the portability of it and actually playing a whole full game you know away you don't have to have it right there in front of the tv and how people say it you know as far as on the switch it seemed like stuff is confined and stuff like that. I find myself like really, really still uh, enjoying the world. It has plenty of space for me, and I can really get into it. So I really have nothing bad to say about this game, man. I'm enjoying it. Uh, and I think other people will enjoy it too. So there it is. I, I think the delay of the game is what's turning me off, you know, because uh, yeah, I'm trying to be objective in this and open, but just – the, the Wii U just left a bad taste, man, because they took so yeah. long to bring this game out. And I think it, for me, it was like a little bit too late. You know what I mean? But um, let's do a final verdict, Mike. Final verdict, Fred. Mike, Zelda, Breath of the Wild, is it a rent bypass for you? Bye, bye, bye. Mike. I'm going to say buy this game, even though I gave it a low rate. I think, I think it is a fun game if you are a Zelda and Nintendo fan. It looks great. Uh -huh. You know, I'm not, I'm taking nothing away from that. It looks great. It's just not a game that I would play. It's not a game for me. But okay. still, go, go it's fair. It. It's fair, man. Fred, we already know you're weird, man. It's all good, bro. <laughs> hey. I keep almost calling this thing the Wii U, man. I, I know you do. <laughs> I can't wait for our verdict for the Switch, boy. Really look forward, forward for that one. All right, so uh, is that it, Fred? Yeah, that's about it.
Okay, so like always, you guys can hit us up at thegamershow at gmail.com. That's the Gamer Show with an A. Don't forget to head over to the Facebook store page. Don't forget to subscribe, become a Gamers Club member. And don't forget to hit us up on VTimes. And please remember to like, subscribe, and follow all our social media networks, join our Steam Minds community, and our website community where you can get some free stuff. And we'll see you next time on WWTF. We want the facts. The Gamer Show. See you next time. Keep on watching. Thanks for tuning in.